<clears throat> Alrighty, welcome back everyone. Like I said, we're gonna try to do the King's Myth, or King's Mouth, whatever you want to call it, uh, thing here. And uh, I don't think we're gonna be putting like a crazy bad situation. So, why don't we uh, think about what we want to do this time around? Hmm. What would be good? I think mechanics would be a good profession to go into. That way we uh, have that ability there, right? Or, uh, you know, we can fix vehicles. We also have the extra mechanics and short and blunt um, skills here, which is nice. What else can we grab? Smoker, of course. Prone to illness, but of course. Um, weak stomach, yes. Short-sighted, yes. Well, we're going to be on an island. I think Sunday Driver's fine as well. All right, what do we want? Well, first of all, cat size. Let's grab Dextrous so we can transfer stuff faster. Graceful and conspicuous would help us out a lot here. I also like having strong and thick skin is cool. We can also get organized. That'll help us boost our uh, container and backpack capacity. Hmm. Let's get Fear of Blood so I have a, an even amount of things here. And then what else could I get? Since we have a no ability to read, Fast Learner would probably be a good one. And then we'll go whoop, to Jonathan Courtney. Welcome, Jonathan. King's Mithile! I'm actually not sure what this is, since the description just says survive on the island of Kingsmith. And, uh, I've probably seen someone play this before, but it's been a while. I don't remember. So, <clears throat> wish me luck. We'll see how it goes. It's an island. How hard could it be? Oh, cool. My boredom's going down. How about we uh, change the channel to Life and Living? That way we can gain some experience while we're looting this house. Why do I have two belts? Anyway, let's go ahead and search, see what we got here. There's a French cabbage. Bunch of stuff like that, okay. How far away can I be from the TV, I wonder? Like it matters, there's nothing else to do in this here area. There we go, cooking experience gained. Man, I'm illiterate, but there's so many books here. I was about to say, if every single nightstand has a book. This is odd. Looks like they messed up the placement for that. Also for, uh... Oh, no, that one's fine. Alright, well. We, uh... Have absolutely nothing... In our, uh... In our house. That we can use as a weapon or anything. Where are we at? So this is the map. Not that big. Uh, much definitely smaller than Louisville. But we have some food and stuff here, which is okay. Let's check the house across the street for anything.
Now let's try to purge some zombies as we go. Anything good on you, sir? Nope. Come on. Strength is just such a good skill. You can just like bully people all you want. Okay. Check out the house next door. Hopefully it has more than just nothing. More than just books anyway. Well, if I just hop through here. So if I just hop through here, oh my god. Oh wait, that's right. They... Oh, you motherfucker. Of course you lunged. Fucking lunging at bitch. How do you like it, huh? Okay. Open the curtain so I can see outside. Oh, we have a can opener. Hooray. That is good. I'm also a juice box. Let's go ahead and drink that real quick. Uh, might as well, right? Okay, what else we got? A bunch of frozen stuff, some canned goods. Might not be a bad idea to kind of consolidate everything into uh we have a garbage bag here. Yes, secondary equip that. I'll put all that over in here. Might be a good idea to consolidate into my house. I'm not gonna take the uh uh bad the items that can go bad yet. Ooh, a taco shell. Oh, there's nothing in here anyway. Never mind. This one? Wait for it. Hey, friend. Howdy, neighbor. I'm here to end your misery as a zombie. Nothing. Another book. Another book. Cool. Man, for them to have, like, nothing in here. Not even, like, a pencil or anything. Absolutely insane. There's not even, like, a storage room, either. I guess this must be, like, a... A resort or something. Fuck that glass break at. Huh? Well, I guess let's just take our uh, food, head across the street, put it in my fridge. That way it's all consolidated, I guess. Still not sure where that glass breaking came from. There are a couple of zombies around, but be fine. Yeah, given how uh, this place looks, it's definitely like a resort of some sort. I don't want him breaking my window. I'll deal with him now. There we go. On the ground with you, buddy. Okay. All right, well, this is a more interesting challenge than just being put into a burning frickin' building and not being able to, like, do anything. Granted, I mean, like, uh, I guess part of the challenge of that is that, you know, you're basically screwed, but I actually like being able to, you know, do stuff. All right, let's check the rest of these houses nearby. Hopefully I can find at least like a, a pencil or something to like write down stuff with, huh? I 
I don't think that Louisville mask is going to help us much here. I guess, hold on. Go ahead and rip up the clothing as best we can here. I would at least like to have some, you know, rags we can use. It'd be really cool if we could find like a bottle of water, a bottle or something. Doesn't even have to be like a, I guess a bottle of water. It could just be a bottle for now. Damn. Our other outfit's food, huh? Oh, there goes my uh, my knife. All garbage. All right. Who's next? Who's next for the bully session, huh? Yeah, that's right. Watch, there we go. Not a digital one, unfortunately, but it will do for now. Hey, friends, come on. Really? Really? So you guys are just gonna walk all the way around to come touch me, huh? There was a lot of zombies over that way. Of course, that one lunged. Why the hell wouldn't he? I think it's time to run away. I guess it was like a better place to try and manage these zombies at. Oh shit. Come on, don't die. Don't die! Push them off! Push them off, man! Come on! Am I bleeding so much? I'm dead. <sighs> Maybe challenges just aren't for me. Maybe they're just not. Just what you want for a security guard, an illiterate Sunday driver, schizophrenic. Excellent. He's also a slow learner. I'm kidding, we're not doing that. But we are going to go ahead and just make this guy strong. We have four points left, so... Make him lucky. And... Welcome, Eve Rosano. To the security guard life. Which, uh, are we actually in the same exact house? Huh, we are. Cool. Well, it's not like we lost anything by being here. These jeans are better protection, though. I tear these black houses up here. Again, don't know why I have this, um, bear belt. So odd. Alright, anyway. Now that we've, uh, died once, maybe we don't go that way. What you got on you, miss? A credit card? Satin... Negligee. Okay. She was getting a little bit freaky deaky before the uh, apocalypse happened. Alright, let's try to find some place that has like weapons or something. I'm a security guard, for God's sake. I should, you know. Have a little more awareness than the other guy who was just like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna go pick up random shit. Right, the random mechanic who was uh, vacationing here, huh? 
than just a normal house. Probably just has food in it. Oh, I'll bully this guy. I don't know. Shit. Plus, zombies to kill later. One more. Good job. Alright, let's run now. Okay, so this little place, I guess, is just like a circle of zombies and houses, huh? Really, no. A watch. Ooh, this could be a good place right here. To at least lure zombies into and then run away from. Alright, let's give it a try. Hey, you zombies, why are you running up that way? You deaf? Comes to be a paintball course, judged by the random planks. Yeah. Maybe something similar. If I can lure them into one of these tennis courts, I can uh, basically have all the zombies corralled into one little location. At least most of them here. Which means that they won't be in my way. Let's go down this street and then we'll go into the, uh, the far end one here. Down a little further because that one zombie's coming from that direction. I can do this. Oop. Run through here. Run where I'm in. Come on, y'all. Come on. Yeah, come on. Come on. Come on in, folks. Try and jump over this. Oh, oh I can. Ah, you bastard. Got me. Alright, come on. Over here. Over here, friendos. Jump this fence. Just the middle one. And then jump this fence. Oh, 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 oh. Run away for a moment. And we're gonna crouch down and disappear into the forest. That way the zombies hopefully stay in there for the most part. Already getting exhausted though. There's more zombies around than I had anticipated in this direction. Did I just feel like laughing. If I go up this way with these zombies that are following me, I can just jump this fence. Lose them there. Gotta be careful about doing this so I don't fuck up. Ooh, okay, that was way too dang close. Keep heading this way. Can I get into here? The answer is no. Let's check this side. I'll be there, but I wouldn't be able to get through even if they do damage the door. The window, I should say. Okay. That would work, but first, crates up here. Maybe I can find a weapon or something. Who can say? Garden hoe, okay. Tire pump. Metal pipe, there we go. Equip that. Seeds up here. Nails. Okay, so there is a way for us to survive. Lighter, I'll need that. Watering can, another lighter. Okay. Nothing else in these. I do need to find something to drink, and pretty quickly, too. 
If I can find any kind of container that would hold liquids, that'd be ideal. Another lighter. Imagine being like a person who ships like boxes and stuff and you uh, look in one of the packages and there's just like a huge box but then just like a little lighter at the bottom and that's all. Actually, what I should do here is this is a dead end, more or less. I could drink from this water if I have to, but let's sit on the ground real quick. We'll just wait until we are no longer exhausted. And then we can start moving out here. Also, might as well level up our nimble here real quick. I'm going to check these three containers here, see if they are openable. If not, we'll head south and, uh, nope, 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 all right. So we just need to find something to drink. That's our immediate priority. Um, after that, we'll see. There were a lot of zombies around in here. What's up with that? Use you, I guess. I'm just firing like automatic fire off over there. We have a. Uh... Why am I slightly panicked? Vending machines could potentially have op and a couple chips in it. Nice. Let's go ahead and drink. I'll drink half of that. There we go. Try to conserve what we have, since until we can get a a proper you know thing going on here, there won't be much we can do. Well, I could have probably just went in here and gotten some. Uh, I can go right now. I could have probably went into one of the bathrooms. And attempted to, uh, you know, drink from the toilet or something. I like the red pen better. I'm gonna remove the pencil. Let's see, what else do we have in here? Piece of tape. Crossword puzzles, money. Maybe there's a bottle of water? Nope. Okay, well, that's fair. At least we found some stuff to mark down some things with. So, center on the map. First off, we know that there is like, there's stuff down here. You know, there's gas there. Um, Where's like a burger symbol? You know, we have food in... Oops, not that one. It's that one. All right. Let's head down this way. There's this zombie over here. Let's go ahead and take them out. I suppose that's good or bad. Oh, that helicopter is there. Look at all those zombies. At least this little area is kind of safe. Am 
my lady. You got something sharp in your leg there. Might take that from you. Scissors, huh? That I need. What was on the ground? Come on out. I knew one of them was going to be a fucking lunger. I hate the lunging zombies. Oh, looks like they found a way to come and touch me, but... Let me go ahead and gear up here for a second. Yep. Sir, I need you to, uh... Screw off, as they say. Alright, let's check again. Anything useful? Anything useful? Nope. Zombies over there. Lovely. I'm trying to get the attention of those two, but uh but that's gonna be possible. That's right, get wrecked. Okay, luckily those two went down pretty easy. Oh, I can take this guy out next. All right. Love to see it. There they are, the last zombie I saw. Anything on you, miss? No, you do not. All right. Really? All right. And that one's open. You know what? I'm just gonna. Probably both of them are unlocked. If I can secure this little area, this building, I mean, um, it'll be really nice because that means we'll have basically an area that's secure from the south. More pop, excellent. Oh, and more chips, all right. Let's get this place checked out then. I suppose anyone's hiding like bourbon or anything crazy in their uh, place here. I'll take that glue. I can use that to repair stuff. Are we illiterate? I forgot. Was it this character or the other character? Uh... No, we're just kind of schizo and stuff. That's fine. I don't think we need to learn any of that stuff yet, though. So let's just ignore it for now. Not a key. real quick so I don't accidentally click it instead of clicking a zombie. Hey, know that. Was that just like a biting sound? That came out of nowhere. Key. Okay. Oh, we got another zombie coming. That's fine. You want to beat down too? Let's do it.
I almost moved out schizophrenia. 100%. Instead, that one looks funner. Oh, Put that on. All right. Next one. There was no one in this uh, this tech room, right? Just filing cabinets as far as the eye can see, huh? If I ever need paper for anything, I know where to come. Howdy, folks. Oh. There's quite a few of you here for some reason, huh? Don't die like this, you son of a bitch. Time to run while we bleed, 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 bleed. <sighs> Took a lot of damage there, but uh, we're all right somehow. One of you followed? Okay. I'll take that. Where the hell did this lady come from? Wait, is your face blue? Look a little blue there for a second. There we go. There we go, damn it, lady. On her. And a key. Okay, they are behind that door. Let's at least uh, try to finish off the ones that we have here first of all. Another key. Did you lose your wig, miss? Or what the hell happened? pipe. That's not ideal. Hmm. Let me go here for a second. Um, did I have a second weapon, or was that the only thing I had as a weapon? That was the only thing I had. Great. Nothing over here already. What about this back wall? Keeping the goodies in here, maybe? No. Shit. Okay. How many more uh, bandages do I have? Quite a few. I don't have anything to disinfect, at least. But I should try and replace them anyway. Okay. Whew.
there if those were uh, painkillers. And finally, the head needs to be replaced as well. Ah, so many lacerations, man. Okay. break room. We can get some water to wash our bandages and stuff. That's great. Okay. Check the fridge. Maybe we can find something fresh to eat. An orange. Let's take that. Need the pear, too. Go. Oh, that'll help our healing. Might as well eat the hot dog as well. Screw it. Why not? Place the lunch bag over here. I'm gonna put that stuff in my main inventory. We have oats, sugar packet. None of that really matters. We already have a can opener back at the other house. Ugh. Raptastic. Yeah, nothing I can use as a weapon though. But. We can uh, clean all of our rags. Perfect. Oh, it's just garbage bags. It wasn't like a uh, some sort of like thing that I missed that I could put water in, right? Uh, drink. I guess we might as well right now fill the uh, mug with water. Okay. Let's check back here. So the bathroom. Any disinfectant, maybe. Ooh, we actually got an actual bottle. Nice. Get rid of this mug of water, then. Dang. No medical supplies, huh? How's a facility like this not going to have any medical supplies in the bathrooms. That just seems a little weird, don't it? What if someone got injured? Did all the lights turn off, or is it just... Were they off before, and I'm just stupid? Behind me, but another workout. You know what? I don't think the letter opener is going to be better than my uh, fists, so. Really? Like, really? Really? Okay. I can't even see what I'm doing. I'm just going off of the green outlines. What? what? In what fucking world did I tell you to climb through a window? idea what the hell just happened there, y'all? Because I have no idea. I was telling them to place down the key ring. And, uh, for some reason, my guy took that as a as a personal assault on his person. 
and said no. Vehicle schematic, volume five, seats, windows, oh. Oh, I can't read them. Huh? Shit, that's what we get for being illiterate. Too much pain to sleep, yeah, that's how it goes, isn't it? Ugh. Eat the banana. Go ahead and replace our bandages to hmm. I could edit settings if I wanted to. I was curious. Also wanted to see if the how I guess infected, because I have a bite, but it looks like I didn't actually get infected from it. And so I think I'm still like if you're bitten, you die instantly. Kind of thing, right? How's the light switch for this place? This is where the bunch of zombies were at before. We're gonna find some disinfectant in here. Why is there a tarp and sheets in here? Nails. Well, we found another weapon. Metal rod. Metal bar, whatever you want to call it. Just nails, huh? Ah. <sighs> well. Shite. Well, the power's not off since this place has light. We're tired now, huh? But we're still in too much pain to sleep, so... I almost did not see this guy. Or just die. Here we go. Who did not want to die? No, how about you just screw off, sir? Alright, we're at we're up where it's bright, so that's good. Is that zombie not gonna come up upstairs? Is it afraid or something? works for me. Let's go to the roof. It does. Looks like any zombies up here that I need to be aware of. Doesn't look like it. Alright, Schizo, calm down. These are lights, right? Or not lights, uh, sun thingies. Looks like nothing's up here at all. Well, that's fine. I didn't want to find anything up here anyway. There we go. I was waiting for that. Finally, you decided to come up, huh? Really? Yep. Yeah, I can't sleep yet. Can you just not, lady? Like, just, just don't. Please kill him before the guy gets back up. What? 
I think you need to look at your hitbox again there, lady, because that did not, like, grab my leg at all. Okay. Let's get out of here, shall we? I was trying to get one through, but not both. Hold on. There we go. Aha! This is what you get for being a zombie, you jerk. Nice. How much more uh, rag do I have? I got four more. How am I doing? Oh, cool. I'll need replaced. Great. All right. I'll go ahead and rip up all the ones that I have here. I'm just going to throw the... Thirty ones on the ground, because through it at this point. Go ahead and eat a cupcake. All right. Am I tired enough to sleep in this chair yet? Not yet. I think my best bet for a place to sleep would be uh, in here. I just gotta get tired enough to do so. But I'm experiencing too much pain. What kind of like CEO people don't like hide bourbon in their stupid freaking dumb face McGee desk drawers and stuff? We have some regularity already. Probably because we're a guy. I don't know. Not a guy. A security person. Hold on. That, was that. Was that my schizophrenia? Or is that really someone who just passed by? Oh, don't replace it with a dirty rag, please. It says I can sleep despite high pain, but it says destroys too much pain, but <laughs> it's just pain. It's not high pain. Maybe because it's not a proper bed or something? I don't know. Mm. It was actually a zombie, not a figment of my imagination. Yeah, get your attention, that little. Oh, come on! Right, Fucking bandage these wounds. You're not gonna get up. Beat the hell out of you. There we go. So sometimes you gotta like find the sweet spot. Just beat a zombie's brains in. A hoodie? Give me that hoodie. Don't put it on yet though. about the same as this thing. Whatever, I'll take the hoodie, though. <gasps> oh, 
Now I can sleep. Finally. Pass some time, get my mood back up and everything. Jesus. Oh, am I gonna die? Because I'm queasy. I mean, I don't know if that's because I'm infected or if it's because I'm just... infected with, you know, infection. Get the fuck out of my way. Now that I'm not tired anymore. Yeah, the map is definitely not color-coded, because that shouldn't be a residential building. I was hoping I could find, like, a medical thing somewhere, but uh, I don't know if that's going to be the case, is it? Oh, a policeman. I'll take your shotgun shells, but sadly, you don't appear to have anything weaponry-related on you. Five more dirty rags for the ground. Might as well take these out of the presence. I think that'll help with my, uh, up there? Maybe? Mm -hmm. That's police. Screw it. Oh, fuck, that's a group over there. Ah, fuck, let's go. Weren't there three zombies? Why am I doing so little damage? Come on. Don't you get up? Piece of shit. Okay, how about this? Screw you guys! I'm going home. Oh right, I dropped my bag because I uh, jumped the fence. I forgot. Hey, you three out there. You see this? This is going to happen to you soon. Hey, a screwdriver. Nice. And we have matches, finally? Oh, my Praise the Lord. I just need to find some cigarettes. Actually, we already had lighters, so I guess it didn't really matter too much. Oh, yay! Exercise fatigue! Oh, all those yahoos are over there. We can try to sneak into the police station. We're probably gonna die, to be honest. Yep. All right, let's gather some zombies up. Oh, look, a nice trailer. That's cool. Come on, you losers. Ooh, big semi, too. Better have had a trailer on it. No, don't go in that way. Come out and around. I can lure you dumb idiots over here. What are you doing? Come on. Come 
on. Right behind me. Do the conga. Just to see what kind of places we have around us here. As I lead the zombies on a Pied Piper's tail of whatever the hell we're doing right now. Key. I would have had like an extra like 0 0.2 seconds maybe I could have but hey don't stop following keep following get my jerk it's just like a warehouse supply store Court up there. Got some more friends for you. You suppose all the zombies are still inside there? Or... Ooh, a bag. Bang! If I could get that, that would be cool. But I don't think I can. There's just too many zombies around. Like, I would have to kill this guy immediately, but nope, he just got stuck, so. Yeah, damn, all the zombies that were in here just decided to go uh, disappear, I guess. jump over this we're gonna keep running because we want to break line of sight for those the main zombies up there That's what we want to do and I can jump this let me just crouch I can just run alongside this one. I think it's my schizophrenia or like what he thinks doing that also, now we're getting exhausted, which is not great either. Or is that a gulfing range, maybe? I thought it was paintball because the things could be used to cover, but maybe not. I mean, it also might not be a bad idea just to let old Eve Rosa die. And then we can become our own, a new person who's not riddled with injury and uh we could actually go do some more stuff she's not carrying anything too amazing on her right now we actually dropped the bag of our goodies back at the uh, more secure location so i think kind of scoping out the city seeing where stuff is would make a lot more sense than just waiting around, right? Also, hold on. I want to check one thing here. So, zombie lore. Do they respawn? Or is it advanced zombie options? I think it's advanced zombie options. Respawn hour. 72. Yeah, they do respawn. Let's just make that not happen. I, like, I, like I said, I think it would be nice if we, you know, don't have that stuff happen. There's also stuff for other things here. Maintenance approved repair. RV interior. Okay. Yeah, we'll apply changes. 
Cool. There are so many zombies in this place. Luckily, we still have our, our chips. Let's snack on them a little bit. Uh, over the package things. There's got to be some sort of like medical facility on this island, right? I mean, there has to be. Luckily, our health isn't decreasing. Doesn't look like, but I think we're just because of that. Look at all of this. They just like gather together and then they just like break apart slowly but surely. It's, it's, I wish the zombies were like better at keeping up with me and stuff, you know. Let's merge these two hordes together. Just run through it again. Get them nice and tight. Okay. That is a lot of zombies. Um, I think that's a... a looks like a... Is that a basement? Or I don't know. Fall down. It's going to be fine. Come on, you losers. Let's go. Oh. You me. Well, let's try to jump the fence now. Perfect. Look. This is why you wear a hard hat. You came from, but that's not cool. Oh my god, why can't I climb through it? I wish E would just work sometimes when you're trying to, you know, jump things. Why are there so many small collections of zombies around? Like, it makes going anywhere just a huge pain in the ass. I'm starting to lose some frames for some reason. Like, are the huge hordes that I'm gathering up, are they just, like, dispersing into smaller little sections? Alright, hold on. Let's give it a second to, to calm down. There might actually be just too many zombies. Some more over there, too. Incidentally, I'm curious. How, uh... Population multiplier is just one. Peak is... That... This is just one level? Surely it's, like, extra spawns for... Oh, shit. For, like, this map specifically, right? It has to be. There's, like, no other way. Now there's this many zombies with just one actor. Yeah, yeah. Arrgh, to you too. Can't even see what's in this game. Stores. One thing that sucks about isometric view. If things are like below you, you can't really tell what the hell's happening. Oh, I can tell why we're lagging now. Jesus. Yep. We're just gonna look away and not deal with that.
What happened to the huge horde that I led over here? Did they all like just piss off or what? Like once they all walk around here and are over here now. There's a little, but not like, enough. See, uh, like like a huge horde that I had. Like I was over here, it's just dispersed now. I'm gonna check this side. Look back. Up the wall, please. First try, baby. Nope, you just screw off, Zoner Man. It's like they have home locations, almost. Where the zombies know that, like, if you get dragged over here... Like, what, what is the, um... Like, in MMOs, where all the monsters have, like, specific locations that they, like, live in. And, uh, if they get dragged too far away, they'll, uh just like stop following you and go back home right is that what this is I'm gonna run for a second look at the map nice I can actually pause it while looking at the map cool this is just a bunch of woodlands huh Nice little park out in the middle of here, huh? Let's run in, crouch, and let's try to get out of here while we lose the zombies. Doing as quietly and sneaky as possible. We have too many problems right now. We're too stressed, which reduces our attack. We're too much pain, which reduces our attack. We're exhausted, which just reduces our attack. Queasy, which doesn't really do anything right now. But yeah, we have 20, 50, negative 100 and like 30 attack. I can't jump this fence. I'm guessing this red fence or this red line here is there. There's a fence around the entire thing. Some sort of. I guess it's a military camp. That's an obstacle course, right? Oh, now we're completely exhausted. Or not completely, but we're uh, almost there. Which means if we get one more, we won't be able to run at all. Actually, we can't run now, can we? Yep. Can I just, like, sleep on the ground? Can I walk around this? Nope. Damn. I'm 
we're out of water now too. I was gonna take a bunch of antidepressants. Why not? Screw it. What's the worst gonna happen? I'm gonna OD. Okay, so if you look at the map. We're here. There's a lake here. That goes back to the park. We have a bunch of zombies around here. Um. Hmm. So yeah, really the only way we could have went from our original spawn was uh. I guess maybe up through here. But if this is also a gap, but it's not a gap, then it's probably not a gap either. I wonder if there's anything over on this way. Like a lighthouse or something. Because there's no, like, land mass there. Oh, shoot. I guess we'll just follow the uh, edge of this lake. See if we can forage for anything while we're out here. If a zombie gets us, we get got. There's nothing else we can really do right now. <laughs> Alright, Schizo, calm down. I want to stay next to the uh, lake as much as possible here. Hopefully there's going to be just no zombies next to it, and we can uh, make it to another part of town. can't even really tell, like, what's around me right now. You know? Have we made it around the edge of the lake? Yeah, now we're just going to go straight down. All right. Oh, what's this? <gasps> Mushroom. Ooh. Well, fuck it. Eat it. We're hungry. That mushroom's stale already? I just picked it. Boredom and unhappiness will increase from eating this one. Yeah, screw it. I need food. The rumblies in my tummy is stopped. Hope I don't, like, die from that or something. <laughs> right? We might be uh, hallucinating or something. Oh, no, we got a zombie. That's why. That's why we were panicking. Okay, how about this? Let's go ahead and um, unequip this. No sense wasting the metal bar when we're doing like no damage anyway. We'll just stomp on his head a couple of times. doing more damage this way. Rising. Alright, moving on. Back to search mode. Come on. Let's find something. Let's just disable it. Another zombie, huh? Come on. You get zombie. Ooh. Too much pain to sleep. Yeah, of course. anymore. If I crouch, then I'll be slower. I'll just have to walk at a normal pace until I fall or something. Can't even sprint. This is literally as fast as I can go. If we run into a horde, I won't be able to outmaneuver them. I 
I can't really even turn around to see if, uh... There's more than one behind me or not. Man, if I run into the trees and I get shorted like that. I suppose this dead guy has over here. Anything on him? Nope. Not that I can pick it up anyway, but I can always look. This might be how we die, folks. If I could maybe get these two to fall or something. Nope, another one just came out. I was just collecting a group there, apparently. Just going through a, a nice walk. With my friends, late at night. That's also not what I want here. Um, I think we're just gonna have to go down. And if we die, we die at this point. Cause I can't see anything. It must be like watching a pitch black screen for you guys at this point. I think I just got grabbed. Yep, we're dead. Okay. So to answer the question, no, we cannot survive uh, Kingsmith. Uh, all right. We could create a new character and keep going with that, but I don't know. It just feels wrong to do, right? Anyway, let's return to the main menu, see what other challenges there are that we could try to do next time. But uh, I don't know if we're gonna. Let's see. So we have studio, which is just like a movie studio, which is whatever. Fog, which just seems like it would be a bit of a pain. Uh, winter is coming. Wait, is winter is coming or storm is coming? Uh, hmm. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do any more challenges. So uh, next time when we come back, let's just start a new game. Use a sandbox and just go at it. Um, we have a bunch of different locations we can spawn in, including a vehicle interior. Huh. But yeah, so I think we'll uh, we'll go to a couple different places here, see how we uh, go out, and we can actually experience some of the mods we have, like you know making biodiesel or getting a huge um, semi truck. If we can get a trailer for a semi-truck, imagine all the stuff we can store in that bad boy. It would be hard to maneuver on roads, but we'll see. Anyway, thank you all for watching as always, and until next time, bye-bye.